in the days leading up to his crucifixion, Jesus entered into Jerusalem. The whole city was stirred up and saying, who is this? Soon after, one of his own disciples, Judas Iscariot, went to one of the chief priests and asked, what are you willing to give me if I turn him over to you? So they counted out for him 30 pieces of silver. At his last supper with his disciples, Jesus said, I will not drink from the fruit of the vine until that day that I drink it new with you in my Father's kingdom. And in the garden of Gethsemane, he cried out, my Father, let this cup pass for me. Nevertheless, not my will, but yours be done. So the soldiers, they took Jesus into the palace. They stripped him down. And they dressed him in a purple robe, put a crown of thorns on his head, and they mocked him saying, all hail King of the Jews. Carrying his own cross, he went out to Calvary. They nailed him to that cross and crucified him. See, he was wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for our iniquities. The chastisement of our peace was upon him and with the stripes that he took on his back we are healed what kind of love is this that while we were yet sinners the king of kings and the lord of lords would die for you and for me as he took his last breath darkness enveloped the sky the ground began to tremble and it appeared as if death was victorious see he died and he was buried, but the story was not over. Rose and is alive again. He lives. He lives. 